Ladies and gentlemen, meet Zanya Monet, a recording artist with millions of views, over 300,000 followers on TikTok, and most importantly, she just signed a $3 million record deal, proving that AI artists are disrupting the music business. Oh yes, in case you didn't catch it, she's completely AI. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to create your own AI artist. And I'm going to do it all in a couple of minutes, so let's not waste any time. This is AI in a nutshell. Alright, so first things first, we need our music. And I suggest getting the music down first, as this will help you craft your AI artist around the kind of music you're making. I actually think Xenia has laid the blueprint in terms of what type of AI music resonates with people, and I don't think you should veer too far away from it. She makes relatable music that talks about real-life situations that people face every day. From parenting... Pack the lunches, did the hair, like you always do. To heartbreak... Not with me, I miss the man that you used to be. Let's stick with heartbreak. For the purpose of this video, our artist will talk about the same talking points, except he'll be doing it from the perspective of a man. So here in Suno, I'm going to say, give me an intense emotional blues song about a good man being heartbroken. Despite his many sacrifices, despite everything he has done, despite his emotional investment and his mental investment, he's been everything he never thought he could be for her. He wonders what the other man has done for her, but at the same time, he doesn't want to know. Getting the right song wasn't easy. I actually had to generate this a couple of times before I got the right song, but we got it. Let's create our AI artist. I was the man I swore I'd never be, but she's gone now, and it's just me. I broke my you can use any AI image generator for this, but for me personally, I like Kling AI, so I'm going to say a modern-day Caucasian blues artist with a punk rock look, stands in a studio in front of a mic singing while holding an expensive-looking bottle of whiskey. I mention the whiskey part because there are parts of the song where he speaks of drowning his sorrows with whiskey. That's why it's so important to create the song first so our AI artist more closely resembles the vibe and tone of the song. As you can see, you might have to do this a couple of times before you get the right look. I like this one over here. Now we need to actually animate him singing the song in the studio. We're going to use Nano Banana. It'll allow us to put our singer in different scenarios while maintaining the consistency and look of our artist. Also, it will allow us to make his movements look natural. So here in Nano Banana, by the way, I'm using the one in LM Arena, not the one inside of Google AI Studio. The Studio One is usually very slow, so most times I avoid it altogether by opening a new incognito tab and searching LM Arena, and then click on the first link. Now up here, click on this drop-down and select Direct Chat. Now click on Image, and you'll see up here it says Nano Banana. I'm gonna say, move the man and change his outfit, move him into a bar where he's sitting drinking whiskey, and you can see here it's given him a completely different outfit and put him in a different environment while making sure he still looks exactly the same. Now, I'm going to say, move the man and change his outfit and put him in an apartment standing with a beautiful woman arguing. Again, it's put him with this woman while making sure he looks the same. Now comb through your lyrics and generate any parts that you think will make great B-roll footage. But we'll leave ours here for now. For the studio singing shots, I'm going to upload the first image here, and I'm going to say, change the man's singing pose, and this is what we get from this to this. Now generate as many as you can to animate our images. You can use Kling or Hailu. We've used Kling a lot on this channel. I think this time we'll use Hailu. So the question becomes, how do we get him singing continuously throughout the song? Because most AI video generators can only animate up to 10 seconds. Well, it's actually quite easy once you wrap your head around it. I'm going to insert a start and end frame. I want him to start of like this and end up here. So I'm going to say, 
man singing song lyrics to the mic. And here it gives us the guy singing. All right, now it's going to get a little trickier, so pay attention. The image that was the last frame in our last generation, I'm going to make it the start and end frame. You'll see why in a minute. Now, see, when I put it together in Premiere, it seems like one continuous shot for 18 seconds. Now for the next shot, keep the start frame the same, but change the end frame. And this is what we get. We can keep doing this to our heart's content and basically make him sing infinitely without any jumps because we're not looping the same animation. Just keep changing what was the last frame and make it the first frame in the next generation until you've got him singing as long as he needs to. For the B-roll shots, these are meant to inject a bit more emotion into the song. Here we're going to say. They argue intensely and then she storms off, leaving angrily. And here's what we get. Here I'm going to say they walk forward romantically in love. Again, just keep generating your B-roll until you've got all the shots you need. As you can see, I've been using Premiere Pro for putting everything together, but you can use any video editor. Now I'm laying every clip exactly where it needs to be, and yes, He's not singing our song right now, but we're going to fix that in a second. Once all the clips are in place, it's time to make him actually sing our song. So Kling AI only does lip sync for a maximum of 10 seconds. That means we can only sync 10 seconds at a time. I know, annoying, but hey, what can we do? So here on Premiere, I'll press I and now. It'll start exporting from this point, then anywhere next to the I, I'll press O. I'm going to drag it to make sure it's 10 seconds or less, and you can tell over here. I'm going to export the video, and now I'm going to export the music. Another problem here is that the audio has instruments playing. And Kling will struggle to hear what words are being said, so we have to separate the instruments from the vocals. For that, I'm going to go to X minus Pro. I'm going to upload the audio on here, and the tool will automatically get to work extracting the vocals. I gave my days, I gave my nights, I built her a kingdom. And here on Kling, I'm going to upload the clip. Now I'm going to upload the audio. Now click on Add Speech. And now I'll click Generate to sync the video with the audio. And here's what we have. She walked away. Left me in this hole. Now just keep repeating the process over and over again until you've synced all your vocals with the singing clips and just like that, your AI artist has their very first song. Before we hear what mine has to say, remember to like the video and subscribe to the channel if you've made it this far. So here's our song. I gave my days, I gave my nights, I built her a kingdom. I fought her fights I was the man I swore I'd never be But she's gone now And it's just me I broke my back I broke my soul But she walked away Left me in this hole Despite everything I still feel small Drowning in the blues Let the whiskey 